Hello friends and welcome back to my channel that is Programming Nation. So, in last uh, video of Quick Basic tutorial, you have seen the you I have taught you the use of print command. So in this pro in this session, I will make you learn uh, s the use of comma and we will make a program in which in which uh, using print command and the comma will be making a table like structure. So um, we'll be starting like writing CLS then the print command. So I will be using comma over here. So I will be printing um, the the title of our program that is marks. Sorry, marks of student in English. So I will be directly ending it because to show you the use of this comma. So I am starting. See, you are able to see that the uh, when we have used comma, you will be seeing that uh, the marks of student in English that has moved little bit forward. But now I am removing it. So, sorry. So now I am running. You will see it will be directly uh, started from the margin. So when we are using comma, it leaves some space gap or space in between. So we will be making a table now with the use of print command and the comma. So um, it is the marks of student in English. I means English subject. So we will directly start. We will starting print. Then we will be using. So which class? Hmm. Class. So it will be class 9th. Uh, uh, which class 9th? Okay we will take 9th B. So next we will run, now we will next line that is, now here also I am using the comma, then the roll number, what are the roll numbers, or the senior number will be better, senior number, or serial number also you can say, then one more comma, then the name, then we will write uh, comma and the in the double quotation I will write the marks marks so out of how, how much that is out of 20 mark 20 so here we will move to the next line the next line I am writing that is blank means I need a uh, gap in between this serial number the and the name marks and there will be I'll, after this I will be starting the um, I'll be starting the name of the students and the marks and this roll number. So print. So here also I'll be using comma. So what is the serial number one? So then what is the name of the student? Mm, Amit. Nice name, no? Hmm. Amit. So I'll be writing next. Now how much marks he obtained? Hmm. He's a, a bright student, so he'll be getting 19 marks. Then print. Uh, comma and then between so second serial number so how what is the name of the student uh, Sohan or Soham 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 so how much marks he obtained oh so he will be getting 15 marks from my side so print so how much marks he will be, uh, what is the roll number the senior number that is 3 then what is the name of the student Ria yes Ria okay sorry Ria so what is the what sh how much marks she got that is uh, okay she is getting 17 marks one hmm then serial number 4 uh, comma and then the name that I will write the name that will be Priya she is getting 15 marks 15 no not 15 she'll be getting okay 18 marks so at last once one more we'll write to complete the table phi then the name of the student so it will be Mohit so after write Mohit, so how much marks he obtained? Okay, sh let him get uh, 16 marks. So we have completed this table now. So now I am running this. 
oh now you are able to see that i have made the uh, the graph like structure so here also i'll be writing i'll be using comma so i am running it marks of student of students in class in english class 9th b senior number and the name the marks and the uh, serial number will be coming under serial number the name the name like amit soham mohit riya priya and uh, the under the name and the marks obtained so like this you can uh, with the use of this comma we can make different things in this quick basic so thanks for watching my video and if you are not sub subscribed my channel please subscribe it and like if you like the video please like it thank you goodbye